Hi guys, welcome back to my channel again. Today I'm going to show you how I make my very own version to egg on bread. A lot of you may know it as eggy bread. First things first, turn the pan on. For the ingredients, you need three eggs, bread, and milk. And if you like toppings on your egg or bread, I've already pre cooked. I cooked some sausages earlier. Right, first, crack three eggs. Splash of milk. Right. Your a little bit of black pepper. Give it a little bit of kick. spit at you. Right, first, quickly, get a bit of bread, dip it in the yolk, make sure it's covered both sides, here's come the messy bit, go on quickly in, you have to do this really quick. Do the same again, turn it over, make sure you get it all, pop it in like so, and the same again. Right, last but not least, the four piece come on, turn over. Come on, there we go. Right, that's covered. Get it in just like that. Move that down a bit. There we go. Don't stick yet. Get it almost into like an omelette shape. There we go, there's that quickly done. Right, and you've got your yolk. Get ready to pour over the bread so it almost becomes like an omelet. And that's the start of your egg and bread. Then, get what you've done earlier. You cut up bit sausages. Put them down there. Right. Place them anywhere you like, how you want it. Just a little bit extra topping. You can use bacon, use ham, whatever, whatever you fancy to put on you. Like if you do like a normal omelet. So this is what I do with mine. In the room. No, that's extra over there. Right. Bring that plate on. This one is there. Quick swing of a cup of tea while you're at it. And you can see I'm a good old Arsenal fan. Good team. Well, I've got it now. Hopefully, we'll win the league next year. Right. Hopefully, that will start to come to boil. As you can see around the outside, once that starts to get to colour and you start to go harden, 
then you can turn it over but as I'm not very good flipping the omelette over I hope this trick will work with a plate I'll show you in a second how I'm hoping it's going to work no, it's not loose yet as I say as I start doing my cooking channels and other things I've got ideas and as I'm a beginner, I'm hoping some of you guys out there who's very good at editing and obviously like when you put your pictures up to say what you got and everything more like that. If there's anybody out there who can help me out to start off as I'm new to this and not very good with computers and hopefully somebody be kind enough to help me out by doing editing videos by putting like music at the start of the video and like the entrance music to the thing and on the end if there's somebody out there who'd be willing to take time to help me do that that'd be such appreciated as hopefully when I start growing I start getting better so when it's almost oh, gets to a I don't know if you can see that very well get to a colour like that I'll quickly bring you over to show you once you almost get especially around here once that start going a little bit more golden especially around the sides then you know ready to flip it over I'll bring you back sorry about that there we go right are you in place hopefully yep right here we go now you can hear that bubbling, so I'm hoping, let's have a quick look underneath. Yep, that's almost ready for a, a turnover. Now you see a lot of professionals, when they do the flip up and over, no way I could do that. I've tried three or four times, and it's like made a mess everywhere. So, yeah, I'm not that very good at that one. I'm a good cook but not an expert cook so here we go I reckon let's give it a quick look again just a few more seconds I'll turn up a little bit so it's a bit more golden that's getting nice and hard now around the sides just like an omelette would be obviously put an egg on bread so um, I'd also like to say thank you so much for whoever's watched my first video. As you can tell, I was a little bit nervous in making that. That's how, how I've done chili con carne. So if you like chili con carne, you don't know how to cook it. Go back and um, watch that, and then I'll show you how it's done on there. Right, one quick chip. Yes, that's ready. Right. Here is my plan of action, how to flip it over without making a mess plate over the side. Ooh. Right, see if we can do this over the seat without making a mess everywhere. Over. So far so good. It almost ended up like that, but it needs to be a little tiny bit more golden. In there like that. Oh, that worked. I'm amazed myself. Right. That to me is perfect. I can't believe that. I'll quickly show you. There we go. Just maybe a little bit more golden on there. I may need to flip it back over just to golden it a little bit more. But there we go. Pop you back up. Oh, the phone's gone on a walk. Hopefully you can get back and see me. Right. Wait for that to start colouring. I'll quit swigging the tea. I'm amazed, really amazed. Now, once you hear that start bubbling away, you know it's almost ready done. Just a little bit longer. And I might need to, shall I flip it over? I'm happy with that. 
actually stay in contact for a change. I'm happy with that. Right. And also, if anybody can help me out doing music, because I only use the iMovie on the iPhone to do this as I'm new, and hopefully somebody's out there that can show me how to do it, which would be really appreciated, as I've got a lot more great ideas what to do for future videos as well. They're not just all cooking base. So I try to make a variety of videos. But as new, just try with the basics first. Right, let's try that trick again. Oh dear, is it gonna work? Get ready. Watch out bad with the noise. Right, try that over this, don't make a mess. Oh yes. I'm happy with that. That, guys, is how to do eggy bread, my version, but I don't know how they do it. It's called, probably called like French toast. But this is my version to egg on bread. I'll pop this down and bring you over to show you more. There we go guys, that's my version to egg on bread. Right, pop it back up. Oh, the other one again. A bit straightening in. Right, for a little extra topping, what I like to use, should have got that earlier, is put a little bit of tomato sauce on, give it a little bit of flavour. That's done. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. If you'd like to try that recipe, just let me know. And also, I'd like to say if anybody knows, as I said, how to do good ed editing and also knows how to like when you show your video first to everybody on YouTube to put your like picture up and things like that to say what it is and extra or like that with to do music as well to put good music at the start and the beginning at the end if you can let me know and help me out by any chance that'd be much appreciated i'd like to say thank you very much for watching and i hope to see you again on my next video thank you guys so much cheers <laughs>